Hi everyone, I am your Punnam Venkat. Today we will discuss about SAP SD, Sales and Distribution. Before going to understanding the Sales and Distribution, first you people want to understand what is meant by ERP, what is meant by SAP, then SAP have how many modules? Of course, yes, SD also one of the SAP modules, but try to explore how many SAP modules we have. And SAP architecture and advantages of SAP, types of projects in SAP, how to log in SAP system and basic settings of the SAP. So today we try to understand these many objectives. Everyone, try to understand what is mean by SAP. What is mean by SAP? Let's open Excel. I will tell you some information about SAP. Basically, some people are calling SAP. Okay, some people calling or SAP. Don't call SAP. Okay, you people want to call as a yes, a. P. What is the full form of SAP? SAP transfer, everyone, concentrated everyone, SAP transfer system application products for data process. I am repeating once again everyone. What is meant by SAP? Don't call SAP. You people want to call as a SAP. Why? Because the full form of SAP system application products for data process. SAP is an ERP package. SAP is an ERP package. ERP package. So you people want to understand what is meant by ERP. So in the market, we have a lot of ERP packages. Example, Arkil, one ERP package. Bon is one ERP package. PeopleSoft, one ERP packages. Even Microsoft Dynamics is one ERP package lot of ERP packages available in the market but in the first place SAP is the first place SAP occupied more than 50 percent of ERP share market in the world so SAP is called SAP is an ERP package so what is mean by ERP why ERP and what is the purpose of ERP you people can understand ERP means E means enterprise. What is mean by E? Everyone concentrated. Everyone E means enterprise. Enterprise. And R means resource. What is mean by R? Everyone concentrated. Everyone R means resource. R means resource. And P means it's a planning. Everyone concentrated. Everyone. P means it's a plan or planning, whatever. Resource and plan or planning, whatever. Everyone, concentrate it, everyone. Concentrate it. Try to understand what is meant by ERP. And what is meant by enterprise? What is meant by resource? And what is meant by planning? Plan, nothing but it's a planning. Plan, nothing but it's an, a planning. It's like a planning. It's like a planning, everyone. It's like a planning. What is meant by resource? Resource means what resource available in the organization. Example, resource means example, uh, money is one resource. And material is one resource. And uh, missionary is one resource. And men, men is one resource, human resource, dot, 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 etc. etc resource then what is meant by enterprise what is meant by enterprise enterprise nothing but organization everyone concentrated everyone enterprise nothing but organization enterprise nothing but organization everyone enterprise nothing but organization then why you start this organization towards get the profits why you start the organization to get the profits to get the profits everyone concentrate here concentrate here everyone so planning resource 
organization and profit so everyone what is meant by erp erp transfer enterprise resource planning to plan the resource to plan the resource how to utilizing in the organization towards get the profits is called erp I am repeating once again everyone, I am repeating once again, concentrated everyone. What is meant by ERP? ERP transfer, enterprise, resource, planning. Enterprise nothing but organization. Resource nothing but men, material, money, missionary, dot, 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 etc. And plan means it's a planning. To plan the resource, where you need to plan? In the organization. To plan the resource. How to utilizing in the organization? Why you want to utilizing in the organization? Towards get the profits. Finally, end of the year, end of the month and end of the day, we want to get the profits. How you can get the profits? Towards utilizing in the, I mean, resource. To utilizing in the resource, then you will get the profits. For that purpose, we need to make the planning. To make get the planning is called ERP. Everyone, this is one definition. Everyone, this is one definition, or this is one scenario. I can explain you another definition or another scenario. I can explain about another definition or another scenario. What is meant by ERP? Everyone, concentrated everyone, especially. ERP transfer, enterprise resource plan. I will tell you one uh, suggestion, everyone. So, a lot of people uh, studied MBA, okay, especially MBA finance and all, even sales and distribution, marketing, HR, different, different branches you studied in MBA. So, in the MBA, third sem, we have one subject. The subject name is called MIS. What is the subject name? Subject name is called MIS. MIS will form Managerial Information System. So this complete Managerial Information System depend upon the ERP. Managerial Information System completely depend upon the ERP. <coughs> everyone, concentrated everyone. On this MIS, Managerial Information System, one author will give the definition, such a beautiful definition he will give. What is what the author is saying? ERP, nothing but all the information available in one place is called ERP. See, different, different authors will give different, different definitions. On this MIS subject, one author saying ERP transfer, ERP nothing but all the information available in one place. Let us assume, I will give you one scenario everyone. I will give you one scenario. Example, in the example, in the organization, in the organization, we have uh, accounts department, let it be, we have uh, accounts department or finance department, whatever finance department and uh, sales department and department. Let us assume marketing department or purchasing department whatever, and uh, HR department, HR department, blah blah. So many departments in the organization. Everyone, everyone, concentrate here, everyone. So I am explaining about author definition. For example, everyone, if you meet finance manager, for example, if you go to finance department, you will get only finance related information. If you go to sales department, you will get only sales related information. If you go to marketing department you will get only marketing related information if you go to hr department you will get only hr related information so what is meant by erp erp transfer as per the author 
all the information available in one place is called ERP. All the information available in one place is called ERP. So, for example, all the information not available in one place. If I want finance, I want to meet finance team. I want, if I meet sales team, I will get a sales information. If you meet HR, I mean HR, HR information, marketing, marketing information. So, different, different departments using different, different softwares. So, I am unable to get all the information at one place. The thing is, the thing is, one second. Yeah. So here, everyone, mm -hmm. different, different departments using in different, different softwares. So in case if I want to uh, get all the information in one place, it's not available. For example, sales department using in different software, finance department using in different software, HR department using in timesheet tools, marketing departments using in some some other tools so here all the information is not available in one place then what is the solution the solution is sap system application products in data process for example sap introduced for example sap introduced for the finance purpose finance and controlling purpose or management accounting purpose, they introduced FICO. For the sales prospective, they introduced SD, SD module. SD module they introduced. And the marketing purpose, example, marketing and purchasing department purpose, they introduced MM. And HR department purpose, they introduced, example, uh, you know. Uh, core HR or success factors, whatever core HR module. So, like PP, PM, uh, like many modules, more than 25 modules available in SAP. For example, everyone in the SAP, one of the best future is called to integrate one module to another module. Integrate nothing but to link between to link between one module to another module. For example, everyone, if I link between FICO to SD, what happened? Finance information is and the sales information is linked. Finance information is available, sales information also available. If I link between, for example, if I link between SD and MM, what happened? This department information is available. This department information also available. If I link between one MM to core HR, if I link between core HR to finance again. So what is mean by this? If I link between one module to another module. So if for example, if you enter uh, your username and password into the SAP software, then you will get all type of information, all the information available in one place. I don't want to go different, different softwares. Only one software for all departmental information like finance information, sales information, marketing information, HR information, plant information, whatever, product information, everything, everything as per the author. ERP transfer all the information available in one place this is the reason sap is the erp package not only departmental information everyone not only departmental information you will get finance info i mean you will get planning information you will get resource information you will get organization information you will get profit information every information regarding to the organization all the information available in one place into the SAP, in the SAP. This is the reason, everyone, this is the reason SAP is the ERP package. SAP is an ERP package. If you enter into username and password into the SAP, then there you will get each and every information. 
ஈச் அண்ட் எவ்ரி இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் சேல்ஸ் ஃபினான்ஸ் மார்க்கெட்டிங் ஹெச்ஆர் பிளான்ட் ப்ரொடக்ட் பிளா 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 எக்ஸ்பெக்டட் எனி திங் ஸோ எனி திங் யூ கேன் பட் தெர் இஸ் அண்ட் சர்டன் ப்ராசஸ் ஸோ வி வாண்ட் டு லேர்ன் த ப்ராசஸ் லைக் வி வாண்ட் டு லேர்ன் வாட் இஸ் த எண்ட் யூசர் ப்ராசஸ் வி வாண்ட் டு லேர்ன் வாட் இஸ் த கன்சல்டன்ட் ப்ராசஸ் ஈச் அண்ட் எவ்ரி திங் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு லேர்ன் இன் த கமிங் கிளாசஸ் SAP is an ERP package. Everyone, basically, this SAP, SAP started at 1970, maybe 1972. SAP started at 1972. 72 or 79, maybe 72. And who started this SAP? Started at 5X IBM employees. 5X. X IBM employees started 1972 where they started at german it is an a german multinational software company it is an a german multinational software company everyone it's a german multinational software company everyone concentrate everyone sap transfer system application products for data process who started this 5x ibm employees was started at 1972 in german it is an erp package so here more than 25 modules is available more than 25 modules is available example let's see this screen you will get let's see this screen example more than 25 modules is available PSD sales and distribution F5 financial accounting CO controlling management accounting MM material management PS project system HR resource human resource then more than SAP have more than 25 modules example this is one phenomena MM PPSD PS HR FSCM CO F5 QM and PM LE blah 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 xyz more than 25 modules in SAP okay so the lot if you learn sap then any module like especially fi co like mm sd then if you learn any module sap have beautiful career for example you are in finance a uh, background go ahead with finance you are a non finance background go ahead with sd and you are in, you are interested in coding go ahead with abap are you interested in securities then go ahead with uh, grs grsm whatever securities uh, basis or whatever and like like this see lot of modules more than 25 modules available in sap okay more than 25 modules in available in sap everyone concentrate here everyone let us assume SAP transfer system application and products data process it is an a german multinational software a corporate company okay it is an a erp package it is an a erp package like sap have more than 25 modules sap have more than 25 modules like sd fi co mm ps hr uh, basis and uh, like you know uh, abap blah 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 x y z even uh, for example who is eligibility to learn sap any module who is eligible to learn sap who completed graduation or who completed your btech bachelors that people are eligibility to learn sap any module any person is learn any module based on your interest there is no any restrictions you can choose sd mm pp basis anything any who are completed your like graduation btech any any anything so that people are eligible to learn any module okay so more than 25 modules is available for example everyone for example let us assume if you learn sap if you learn sap 
or if you learn SAPSD, especially if you learn SAPSD, how many types of job opportunities available? How many types of job opportunities available? For example, everyone, if you join, if you complete SAPSD, there is a two types of job opportunities. One is end user job opportunities and one is consulting job opportunities. If you learn proper SAP SD, sales and distribution, you will get two types of job opportunities, everyone. One is end user job opportunities and one is consulting job opportunities. Consulting job opportunities. For example, join as an end user in any organization, their corporate sales or any other sales related departments. Example, what type of companies as an offer in end user? Example, Coca-Cola, Pepsi, Unilever, Reliance, BHL, and this type of companies offered as end user jobs. And otherwise, join as a consulting firm. Join as a consulting firm and develop career towards become a SAP consultant. So what type of companies offered as a consultant job? Example, Accenture, IBM, Capgemini, Infosys, TCS, Deloitte. So this type of companies, they offered as a consulting related job. Everyone here in our course, in our course, here we will teach end-to-end -end process of end user and end-to-end -end process of consultant. Both we will teach end to end. Both we will teach end to end process. So in the end of the session, for example, everyone, when you are become a good consultant, when you are become a good consultant, means end of the day, the consultant want to support the end user. When the consultant want to support, when you know that process, when you know the end user process, then only he will going to support. Otherwise, how you can support? So that is the reason. In especially in our class, we will teach the end-to-end -end process of end user and end-to-end -end process of consultant. Both process end-to-end. -end. In the end of the sessions, even based on the student's interest, we are conducting some mock interviews. So based on the mock interviews, we are going to guide you. So first you can go to as a consultant, first you can go to as an end user. So we can give you some suggestions. We will provide you some job assistance, like how to prepare the resume, how to upload the resume, how to attend the interviews, what is the interview question and answers in both consulting way and end user way. Both we can. Okay. So based on our guidance, based on our guidance, you people want to prepare your resume and you people want to attend the interviews. Okay, this is called, we are called as a job assistants. We are called as a job assistants. Everyone, concentrate here everyone, concentrate here, concentrate here everyone. The types of projects. And before going to types of projects, we we'll just try to understand and, and what is meant by SAP and ERP, types of modules. And what is meant by SAP architecture? Everyone, this is very, very, very important. Everyone, you people want to understand SAP architecture. You people want to understand SAP architecture. <clears throat> everyone, concentrate here, everyone. For example, SAP have, let's open Excel. SAP have R by 3 architecture. Which architecture? R by 3 architecture what is mean by r and what is mean by three <laughs> what is mean by r and what is mean by three everyone concentrate it, everyone r means real time data process what is this r means real time data process real time data process Real time data process. Real time data process. Time missing. Real time data process. And what is meant by three? Three means it's a three layers. 
three means it's a three layers everyone it is an a three layers example uh, let us assume uh, uh, presentation layer then application layer and database layer layer means three layers so what is mean by real time data process what is mean by three layers this is you people want to understand this is you people want to understand everyone can concentrate here, everyone example i can give you small definition in this demo in the coming classes i can go in deeply how we will get the real time data process and all for for your understanding purpose i can give you some some basic information let us assume real time data process means let us assume one of my client one of my client using in two banks one is icici bank icici bank and one is using in hdfc bank one of my client using in two bank accounts example let us assume example let us assume we, they are using in two banks we are now we are try to understand uh, real time data process every what is mean by real time data process let us assume one of our client one of our client using in two banks one is icic bank and one is hdfc bank <coughs> let us assume my question is is icic bank statement and hdfc bank statement is same no icic bank statement format hdfc bank statement format both are not same that is something is different but sap but sap support both sap support both formats so what you people want to understand here how the client is required the information that type of information provided by the sap how the client is required the reports maybe configuration i mean customizing report maybe standard reports how the client is required the reports that type of reports provided by the sap so how the client is required the information that type of information provided by the sap sap is an a user friendly software of course it is a some process is big but if you learn in the proper manner it is an user friendly such a beautiful software such a beautiful software everyone so sap system application production data process one second ba 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 such a beautiful software everyone so now <coughs> now you people want to understand like uh, what is mean by three layers like uh, some more information we will discuss in coming classes okay and uh, what is mean by presentation layer what is mean by database layer and what is mean by application layer <laughs> so everyone presentation layer nothing but everyone concentrate here everyone i can give you now some basic information coming classes we will obviously we can go to discuss in depthly so everyone presentation layer means presentation layer means wherever you are entering the inputs wherever you are getting the results that is called presentation layer try to understand where you are entering the inputs where you are get the results where you are see the results that screen is called presentation layer if you enter in the inputs if you enter any inputs that inputs that inputs will go to database layer the results will come from the database layer results will come from the database layer so application layer nothing but it is an a bridge 
it is an a bridge between presentation layer and database layer database layer nothing but storage location database layer nothing but it is a storage location presentation layer nothing but where you are entering the inputs where you are seeing the results that screen is called presentation layer so application layer nothing but it is an a bridge between presentation layer and database layer example everyone let us assume i can give you one example everyone i can give you one example let us assume let's take the google open your phone and let's take the google there you are entering some inputs how to cook indian recipes how to cook indian recipes if you press enter so lot of information lot of videos will coming on your screen so where you are entering inputs how to cook indian recipes you are entering into the presentation layer where you are seeing your information some videos on the presentation layer that information and uh, videos coming from the database layer so application layer means it is the bridge between presentation layer and database layer it is the bridge between presentation layer and the database layer so everyone who have in sap work with on the three layers one is presentation layer application layer and database layer presentation layer application layer and the database layer sap similarly sap also work with three layers i will show you what is mean by presentation layer on the presentation layer who will work on the application layer who will work end user consultant technical consultant basis consultant who work on where each and every point we are going to explain let's see the screen everyone let's see the screen everyone we have presentation layer application layer and database layer here the users if you enter any inputs the user if you enter any inputs on the presentation layer that in that information will goes to first database layer via application layer so results also will come come from database layer via application layer application layer is the bridge between presentation layer and database layer database layer nothing but storage location if you enter any inputs the results will come from there results will come from there so it's called sap r by 3 r by 3 r means real time data process 3 means it's a three tier architecture three tier architecture okay so what is the advantages of sap what is the advantages of sap sap advantages integration of various module here i can explain na here i can explain integration of uh, like fi co2 sd sd to mm mn to hr hr to fi blah 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 like so it we are integration of various module so coming classes i will explain you each and every integrations maximum integrations we will discuss okay whatever we required okay whatever integrations we required that integration we will discuss like fi to sd of i mean sd to mm sd to fi and different different integrations also we will discuss faster and cheaper <laughs> sap is not a cheap actually it's a very fast why very fast means sap will uh, maintain very good servers in the three layers like development server quality server like production server i will explain you types of servers in sap or system landscape i will explain you so based on that servers sap is very fast and why we mention the cheaper means why we mention the cheaper means sap provide real time data process how the user is required the reports customizing report standard reports so that reports compared to other erp sap is cheap okay and sap available multiple languages more than 40 languages available sap available multiple currencies more than 200 currencies available in sap 
SAP available multiple countries, more than 190 plus countries available in SAP. If you learn SAP in the proper manner, wherever you go, which country you go, you will get the SAP related job. That is the beauty of SAP. Okay, that is the beauty of SAP. Wherever you go, SAP is there. <laughs> so which country, wherever means, which country you go, which country you go, SAP is there, there uh, SAP job opportunities is there. Everyone, that is the beauty of SAP. So what type of job opportunities? Maybe end user job opportunities and consulting job opportunities. They provide two types of job opportunities. End user job opportunities like this type of companies offered as end user job opportunities. Consulting job opportunities, this type of companies offered as a consulting related job opportunities. I already explained. Okay. And uh, types of projects. Everyone, types of projects and basic settings of SAP. So, types of projects, how to log in the SAP and basic settings, we will discuss in the next class. Okay. Uh, yeah. Thank you, everyone. And uh, thank you. I'm your Punnam Venkat. If you like this video, please subscribe and share. Thank you. Bye-bye.